A loot proposed by TxDOT in Jacksonville is being met with mixed emotions tonight. This after the city council voted unanimously to be in opposition of this relief route. That's what they're calling it. Fox City One's Lauren Margolis tells us why not everyone is on board. Building a loop is not a new concept for East Texas. Henderson has one, Athens has one, uh, obviously Tyler has a couple. But Jacksonville City Council is not so sure it will be a good addition to their city. Many believe it will hurt businesses along Highway 69, negatively impacting the city's economy. Council members are concerned less people will stop and make purchases at Jacksonville shops. Vehicles would be bypassing the downtown area or our main business district. And so that was a concern for a lot of our business owners. Highway 69 also serves as a hurricane evacuation route, which would be activated for those seeking shelter when a big storm is targeting the Texas Gulf Coast. A study conducted by TxDOT in 2018 recommends this loop, stating that it would ease congestion and improve safety in case of mass evacuations. But the city voted unanimously against it. We actually discussed it at our workshop first, and the council uh, did opt to put it on the agenda and take a formal vote. Many fear it could also impact the environment, or even possibly leave some properties without access. This is Highway 69, and TxDOT believes it's a heavily congested area. Right now, commuters driving on the highway are also forced to drive through the city. And it's not only council members in opposition of the project in their city. Uh, we did have seven or eight uh, residents sign up to speak that night, and all of the people that spoke on the bypass route uh, were opposed to the route. It is ultimately TxDOT's call to make. Lauren Margolis, Fox 51 News.